Welcome back to the best news show ever. You got that one right. Let's go to some news. NHS will be having the SAT on October 1st. Seniors, this is a great opportunity for you to have scores in time to submit to college and scholarship opportunities. Go to SAT.org to register. The late registration deadline is September 20th. The HBCU College Fair is on Thursday at Carmel High School. Transportation will be provided and there is no fee. If you are interested, you can find more information at the BSU Instagram. It's sad one today. Off to training today. The music industry might be losing one of its biggest artists soon. The Holly Jolly Christmas singer Michael Bublé has decided he wanted to focus on being a father after he says he doesn't love making music as he once did. Now, after this depressing news, off to meetings. Check out the speech team call out on September 12th during AL. The meeting will be held in room 1060 and begins at 215. Make sure to pick up a physical pass from outside of the library by room 1228. The library is aware of this, no need to check in. The Noblesville Students for Life Club will be holding a meeting on Thursday, September 8th during AL in room 1246. Request an e-hall pass for Mrs. Ellis to attend. If you're interested in Art Club, there is a call-out meeting Thursday, September 8th in Miss Levi's room during AL. Get a pass from Mrs. Evans to attend. There will be a France and Spain trip over spring break 2024. Mrs. Ringel will be holding a meeting on Tuesday night, September 13th at 6.30 in room 2200. If you can't make the meeting or need more information, please stop by her room. The Spanish club will be meeting today in AL at 2.40 in Mrs. Delp's room. You must request a pass from room 1220 30 minutes prior to the meeting. The STEM Club is having a call-out meeting Monday, September 12th in room 2249 at 2.40. If you are interested, e email Caroline Thompson or Miss Foy. The Peonies Club will be holding a call-out meeting on September 14th in Mr. Abel's room. Contact Mr. Abel for more information or for an e-haul pass. The LSU is having a meeting during AL today. Please request an e-haul pass from Mr. Dewing if you wish to attend. That's all we have for news today. Let's toss it over to some sports. Hi Millers, Mr. Smith here again. Been a long time. Gonna tell you about some fun you can have Friday night. There's a home football game. Watch the Millers get a win. Come, bring some cash. Leo Club is selling, having a bake sale so you can get cookies, brownies, you name it, all kinds of good stuff. And the opportunity is back for chicken selfies. That's right, chicken selfies are back. Look for these signs. well-made signs I might add look for those signs on Friday night come get yourself a picture with a chicken get something to eat watch the Millers get a win see you Friday hello NHS I'm Sean Wood and welcome back to theater news we are thrilled for a new year congrats to the casting crew of our fall musical production of Chicago we're excited for a fun musical and all that jazz and join us every Friday for Fosse Friday dress in your best jazzy ensemble Another congrats to the 2022 competition show of the cast of The Boy Who Was Asked to Turn Blue. Join us Saturday the 17th for a fun-filled day of theater at Butler Theater Day. Come and donate your canned goods to TOTS Trick or Treat so students can eat. Bring your goods to the auditorium lobby from September 26th through October 7th. Have a great day, NHS. Welcome back to sports news with the most iconic sports anchors out there. Let's get into it. The boys tennis team had a tough game on Tuesday against Westfield, falling short with the final score being 4-1. to 
Camden David and Caden David getting the only point that night. Make sure to check out their next game tonight at home against Franklin Central. On September 6th, your boys varsity soccer team fell to Westfield with a score of 1-0. Shout out to Jackson Montgomery and Landon Huber who dominated the midfield. Uh, show out to their next game tonight at Southport High School at 7.30. Let's swing it over to pro sports. WNBA legend Sue Bird retires. Tuesday, she played her final game with the Seattle Storm. During the post-game interview, fans cheered their appreciation for her 20 years of playing. Bird tried to hold back tears, but couldn't help but let it all out. Now back to sports meeting. On Friday, September 16th, there will be a boys track and field meeting in the Junior Senior Cafe. If you have any questions, email Coach Kenley and Coach Muvik or visit their classrooms. If you're interested in boys volleyball, there will be multiple open gyms held this month. The first open gym will be held today at 6.15 in the main gym with pickup at 8.45. Reach out to Coach Gannon in room 1200 or by email for any questions. Well, that's all for news today. Have a good week, Millers. See you next time.